and welcome back to Grace New Hostess. It's so exciting because I was a winner of some of Florette's brand new originals. Okay, I didn't win some of them. I won all of them. And all I did was unbox it, uh, took the tape off so I could share with you first and foremost. For you that don't know, my name is Christy and I am documenting this journey of a cut flower farm, a you pick your farm, CSA, all the things and this is very much a part of my journey and ah, oh my goodness, I'm so excited about this. So I actually won this over from Scott at the Flower Podcast. He was the one who um, I saw this on and he picked three winners and i was one of the three winners out of over five thousand people and it says i hope you have so so much fun growing these aaron and you guys know where this is going right it's going in a frame over inside of my shop so i'm super excited about that i will absolutely be holding on to that um so oh i wonder what it is oh so, okay, I have a guide to growing Florette <laughs> originals, and look, there's the cat on the back. And um, I just got a kick out of that because we have a lot of cats on the property, if you don't know. And one of my sons is infatuated with cats. He absolutely loves them. But now we're getting ready to get to the good stuff. What everybody's been waiting for. What did I get? These are so exciting and beautiful. Okay, let's start here with the zinnias. I will definitely be reusing all this. Yes, please. So I have the zinnia Alpine Glow. I have the zinnia Dong Creek Blush. I wanted you guys to see like how beautiful all these are. I have Dawn Creek Honey. Ooh, Dawn Creek Pastels, Dawn Creek Peach, Zinnia Golden Hour, Little Flower Girl, I have Zinnia Precious Metals, I have Victorian Wedding, and my oldest loves this Zinnia Unicorn Mix. Okay, next up we have the Dahlia Bees choice oh they are so pretty and then we have the cancan girls i like this as well oh and the pretty florets i love the colors and the shooting stars i don't know if it's just me but the shooting stars remind me a lot of the unicorn so there we go mm -hmm. I get, I get. All right, next up we have the Celosia. Oh, we have this Autumn Blaze. This year I am intentional. I will be very intentional about getting more photos. I rarely have any photos, so this is something I'm going to be super intentional with this year. So we have the Celosia Autumn Blaze. We have the Celosia Coral Reef. We have the Celosia Dusty Rose. We have the, ooh, Celosia Glowing Embers. <gasps> Look at this Lemonada. This is really, really pretty. We have this Pink Chanel. It's very beautiful. This Celosia Raspberry Lemonade. Ooh, Rose Gold. I love Rose Gold. But I like the Sangria as well. And the Spun Sugar. And the Summer Sorbet and Vintage Rose. I'm so glad that I didn't have to pick because honestly, I love them all. And even though I really love soft colors, I don't know. These were just, they were just hidden beauties in all of these. And I'm so super glad that I'm able to have and grow them all. And last, we have this sweet, sweet, sweet bonus. And I'm not sure if it was because um, this is the package. I'm not sure if it's because this was a giveaway. But there are some Sparky Sunflowers. There is some Dawn Creek Blush Corn Cockle. Agristema! Woohoo! And there's some Chinese Forget Me Not Miss Marilyn. I'm excited because I think of everything I wanted to grow this year, 
Um, this Agristema was one of the things that I didn't get. And the other one that I didn't um, get to get were Rebecca. So I'm so excited of everything I wanted to grow this this year i have so thank you so much um over to scott at the flower podcast thank you so much to florette for just being such an example such an inspiration i want to say thank you so much over to scott at the flower podcast oh for hosting this you have no idea you have no idea Thank you. Thank you so much. And I cannot wait to chat with you again and maybe be on your podcast. Wink, wink. <laughs> and thank you, Florence, for just being such an incredible example of what hard work and determination and faith looks like in action. The fact that you've been working on this project and others for over seven years is just amazing. And I think what you're doing and what you're giving is so phenomenal. And I'm so thankful to be um, on the recipient end of this and just able to have a piece of you here. And it would be amazing one day if you came and graced the grace-filled gardens <laughs> and took pictures of what's going on in a small little space all the way in the middle of the country that's just growing. Um, 26 plus 16 of your flowers. So thank you so much. Thank you guys for watching. I just wanted to share this moment. I wanted to document this portion of the journey because truly this is amazing. And I think that this is going to be life changing for me and for my flower farm. Until the next video, peace and blessings. In case you missed it, I also won another um, giveaway that she was hosting um, just right before, literally probably a week or two before. So if you didn't see that reel, I got some bread seed poppy. I got some love in a mist transformer. I got some sweet pea, uh, pin cushion flower, fever few, queen Anne's lace, another pin cushion. Shirley Poppy, Mother of Pearl, Crest, Penny, um, Celine, Blushing Lanterns, Honeywort, Pride of Gibraltar. And I don't have a lot of these. Um, and yet, I haven't grown them, so I'm super excited. Shirley Poppy, Bread Seed Poppy, another Bread Seed Poppy, and a different Crest.